one of the other accusations is that these elephants uh, are chained. Mm -hmm. they're, they're, they're trying to um, uh, equate the, the elephants at the Pinavala sanctuary to elephants like that were suffering in uh, zoos like in Pakistan, mm. where it was abandoned, not taken care of, and it was pretty much, you know, um, dumped, uh, that, that carbon, the elephant. Um, so what is the reason that you all have to chain the um, elephants and I, do you all chain them and uh, I mean I, I would understand they would have done it earlier on hmm. but right now with all the information you all have, with all the relationship you all have with these animals, is there a need for that or what exactly is your thought process, your, your organization's thought process about that because people don't like to see anybody in chains, mm -hmm. we don't want to be in chains, even we, with dogs we don't want to put them in chains, we want them to roam around naturally, you know, one of, that is one of the things that these guys are harping on, so explain to us what's the need for that. Yeah. Uh, so before I exp answer that, let me tell you. So if you saw this video, uh, we had yes. four elephants. None of them were chained, right? Even our um, mahouts did not even use the bull hook, right? The bull hook was there only to use if it was necessary, right? So see, you're a, you can be an animal activist, right? Uh, you're interested in animal welfare. That does not mean your sole job is to criticize everything. You just go to the Facebook profiles of these uh, people, they have never ever appreciated a single thing, single effort by anyone, not alone a government organization. So they are trying to continuously bully. They're trying to bully me or they're trying to bully, actually they're trying to bully or harass the position that I'm holding. So they have actually done it. But with me, I don't think, I, I won't give that chance, I'm fighting back. So that is why there is resistance and this should happen at some point because these guy have, guys have been attacking the zoological gardens and all the other environmental ministers, uh, the minister, state ministers, the cabinet ministers, the president. See, even here, they are attacking the president also. So this has been a practice and, and this they are supporting, I need to say this, and they are actively supporting Sajid Premadas, uh, the, uh, the opposition leader, uh, even though I don't think you are in a cap capacity to say that, but if you go and see, they are supporting everything that Sajid Premadasa does. So you can see the politics of it. And this is what we are trying to say. Uh, these guys, if they were honest about it, if they were, I mean, if they had really cared about let's say um, uh, I want to get a response to that chain thing but before that if by any chance let's say that, that they were concerned uh, mm -hmm. how these elephants are treated why not sit down and have a conversation with you uh, why not give you give some ideas to you hey hey why can't we do that how, did they do, do that with you uh, actually this rare uh, the lady who's in charge Panchali reached out to me so uh, uh, one thing, she, when she came and sat with me, I said like, before anyone comes for a meeting with me, I do a background check because I want to know what are their intentions. So I saw she has continuously attacked the officials and the zoological gardens and everything. So the very first thing I said, if you are ever going to challenge the very existence of the organization I'm heading, I have no interest in working with you, right? That's very natural. You can't be a stakeholder and working with me if you're going to challenge the very existence of me. The second thing is uh, she wanted me to become like she wanted to expose our elephants uh, in, in one of her dollar making projects, right? She uh, gave me a CV of somebody, said he's an expert in elephant giving um, pedicures to elephants. Uh, but when I look at, looked at the CV, he had been just a zookeeper at some, any, some other country. Whereas, come on, the Pinnaval Elephant Orphanage has been in existence since 1974. And our doctors and our vets, they're giving pedicures enough care to our elephants. And at the same time, if at all, we need expert advice. We have our indigenous uh, Veda Mahatyas, right? Actually, there are certain Veda Mahatyas we are uh, 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 making uh, use of, right? Uh, so, shall I answer your chain question? Yes, please. <laughs> yes. So, see, this is uh, an elephant sanctuary, true. But there, see, they're going to the river sometimes uh, in the middle of uh, people. There's a lot of people. As zoological gardens, we have to take care of elephants. And at the same time, we have to take care of our visitors as well, right? Uh, and the other thing is, most of the elephants, 
when they are alone or when they are in the field inside we keep them without chains right so as long as they are alone and uh, in that environment they are very calm but when you put them in the herd because that is when they go to the river when you put them in herd there are certain hierarchical matters right that's uh, elephant politics elephant <laughs> politics so one bull is trying to show okay i am hierarchically yeah. uh, on top of you or i am i'm stronger than you something like that this is like animal that. world this is animal world so in such a situation if they start attacking each other or if they start getting aggressive right say if a bull elephant all of a sudden gets aggressive there has to be like in order to control him we have to put the chain around his neck when he is aggressive if we try to put the chain around his neck it will be damaging so the elephant so that means you would have uh, before if anything happens you all have identified this elephant is a little bit dodgy with, with the herd your 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 doctors your physician they know that your scientists know exactly okay we need to keep an eye on this guy on this, this guy is a little bit dodgy that, is that what it is it is it is exactly that that's what it is so there are certain bull elephants when you put them in the herd they might become aggressive because of this hierarchical issue so that is why before you become an activist you have to <laughs> know about elephants right oh,